Ladies and gentlemen, listen, so we made it out to Japan. We out here, we're on Japanese soil. Y'all can see my feet, hold up, wait, let me zoom out. Y'all can see my feet? We are on Japanese soil. Now, here's the problem. There's, there's good news and there's bad news. The good news is I made it to Japan safely and I surprisingly didn't get lost at all. The bad news is, you see that? See that building right there? Let's, let's zoom in on it, you see that building? That's where I'm staying. That's like my, my, uh, my like, guest house hotel thing. The problem is, it's currently like three something, and they said I can't check in until four o'clock. Normally, I could check in in any other hotel at like two o'clock. But no, not today. Oh shit, this is a nice ass water. <laughs> we got some nice traditional buildings, look real nice over there. Guys, when we get to Akihabara, like, I mean, we're in Akihabara right now, but like, when we get to like the, the otaku section, it's a wrap, y'all already know what it is. Now y'all know I'm about to go in here, right? The Sega, the Sega building? Like, I'm not even sure if it's an arcade or what, my dudes, but you know we going in here. It's about to go down, my boys. Okay, y'all, so y'all know for a fact, ain't nobody winning this. <laughs> ain't nobody winning this. I know some of y'all out there thinking you win this, but nah, dude, these are extra hard. Like, I, I've done these Japanese-style cranes, and like, okay, they're not too bad, but these, Nah, my dude. We got some quality items. Look at this. We got a Kirby toy helicopter. I definitely want me one of those. We going up. We on a Tuesday. About to play some games at the Sega Arcade. I got nothing. I'm so sorry, guys. Don't don't unsubscribe, please. All right, so we got more crane machines, more crane machines. Nothing too special, yeah. You know, we've seen it all before. But you can win these these lewd toys. Can I show this without getting demonetized? I probably can. I think I'm right. Look at this guy, dude. He's going in. What? This man. Oh my God. Look at this god right here. Dude, he's got the mask on and everything, dude. He's got the mask on. Oh my god. There's four players, like, they're just like 2v2s out here. Like, what the? Bro, I, I'm moving, bro. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm leaving, dude. I'm moving. Bro, even in Japan, ain't nobody buying this shit. <laughs> ain't nobody buying this Nintendo Labo, my boy. It's just crazy. My dudes. I just found the Square Enix Cafe. Oh my god, I didn't think I would find it. Yo, I was just walking randomly, like walking randomly around this area. Like no, no direction, no GPS, and I just see it. Kablam! Square Enix. Hold on, wait, let me get the whole word. <laughs> let me get the whole word. Hold on, wait a minute. Square Enix Cafe. Wow. We gotta go in here. We gotta see what this is all about. Bro, they got the Octopath Traveler characters. Everybody's here. It's a cafe for Octopath Traveler. Square Enix. <laughs> oh man, I'm in love. I'm in love. I don't even have. I don't have words, y'all. I don't have words. This is wild. Like, are y'all actually seeing this? They got Primrose. But let me let me focus on her. Wait, oh my God, I'm bad at focusing. Primrose. We got little mini sets. This is really amazing. They really got Super Famicom, Final Fantasy games, man. They got everything you need here. It's too sick, man. I'm in the home right now of just Otaku Land, man. This is look at this stuff. Like I, we we not even done. Like that was like a that was like a corner, my boys. My Hero Academia. We got little Deku. We got this asshole hero. I hate him so much. Now I know what y'all thinking. Y'all think of you. Who buys CDs anymore? Guess, guess who buys CDs? 
Yeah, boy. Guys, I got like soundtracks from like every anime I like watched or grew up on, bro. Like, it's crazy. I even saw a Saint Seiya uh, uh, freaking soundtrack, man. Like, <laughs> your boy about to pick all this, so I'm coming home broke. Here it is, guys. I found it. The Holy Grail. The Splatoon Isle. Japanese Splatoon stuff. It's everywhere, man. You can buy little replicas of the guns. Look at that. Hold on, wait. Let me, let me get that in focus. Let me, I got you guys. I got you. Hold on, hold on. Bam, boom. You can get like literally all the little guns. That's like little mini figurines. That's actually cheap. Three three dollars and thirty cents if you if you want to get like specific with changing that from yen to uh, U.S. dollars. They got rings. I guess I don't know what those are. Platoon rings? Oh, what the hell? I'm about to buy all this though. Y'all know what's about to happen, right? Y'all know I'm about to buy this. Okay, guys, I turned the camera on. I had to turn it back on just to show you this. They got the actual scrubber from Splatoon. If you like press this, it changes the abilities. That's so crazy. You guys see it? I mean, it's like a kid's toy, obviously, but like, that's sick, my boy. It's like, are you serious right now? All right, y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all something. I was in this store right here. Look how big this store is. Wow. All the way up, right? I was in that store for like three hours, my dude. And then I was like, all right, I guess I got everything, you know, I, I wanted to see, you know, out of Akia Bar. But then I realized there's a whole nother goddamn store right next to it just as big. Oh my God, I can't, dude. I'm gonna just wait for somebody to get on this stage. And they know they're trying to get my sizzle right now. They got the, look at this controller. That's pretty sick. Damn, this, this is straight up station, like both sides poking, dude. That's wild. Man, I'm, I'm definitely playing a couple rounds of this. Okay guys, what up? It's day two in Japan. This time I decided to head over to Shibuya City. You know what I'm saying? And yo, oh, here it is guys. The famous Shibuya Crossing. It's right here. You guys can see that how many people cross this daily. They see something like, there's like millions of people who like cross this every day. I could be wrong, maybe I'm exaggerating, but yo, this is it, this is pretty cool. Man, it's mad people here. So I was told that <laughs> this place was gonna have a ridiculous crowd, but damn, bro. This is New York City, man. This is Japan's New York City. It's mad people everywhere. So crossing Shibuya Crossing is gonna be our goal right now. Yo, hold up, you see that? That Luffy and Goku? And I don't know what he's from, but yeah, he looks cool. Oh, here we go, we're about to cross, we're about to cross right now, hold up. Oh my god. I know it probably doesn't seem like much to you guys, but crossing Shibuya Crossing, man, like people, people dream about doing this, man. I'm pretty, I feel pretty blessed to, to have this opportunity, man. Yeah, they got mad anime shit everywhere, dude. I, it's too much, too much shit to look at. I can't do this, guys, I can't. Bro, I'm about to get that in my apartment, you know what I'm saying? Get that, uh... I don't know what the hell that is. All right, y'all, so we now about to go inside the Disney store. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh. Anyway, we're about, we're about to go inside the Disney store. Now, the reason why this is a big deal is because most of the Disney stores in America were closed. So we about to see what Japan has to offer. All right, now, I don't know where we're about to go now. This is like some cabin show. What the hell? Oh, hold up, we about, to, we about to enter some shit, hold up. Oh, okay, it's just another part of the store, dude. I thought we was about to enter, enter some magical land. I mean, this is magical, though. All right, y'all already know what it is. Gotta come down to the game section. He's still trying to sell me this Nintendo Labo that I will never buy. <laughs> I'm never buying it. Bro, they just got Super Famicom just lined up, dude. That Monster Hunter Wii U exclusive edition. Ah, uh, look at these Amiibos, they're so fresh, dude. They're just clean and fresh. All right, now in Japan, y'all still using strategy guides? Like, come on now, y'all. We got Google for that now. What y'all doing? All right, y'all, I found another gold mine. You know what it is. They got the Splatoon music section. This is the whole, we got the Pearl Marina. Um, I think this is like the, their, their soundtrack, like for their concert. 
And then you got the Octo Tune. I don't know what this is, but this looks dope. And then we got, I think this is just the original Splatoon 2 soundtrack. Bro, it's crazy out here. They really got these soundtracks like, it's so good, man. I, I'm about to pick one of these up, yo. So y'all know what it is. I had to get some sushi. Oh, it's so fresh. Look at the color, guys. It's just, I, I can't wait to dig in, man. I can't wait, guys. And they and they bring it out like there's like a little conveyor belt, and it just goes, and then it comes here. And you just pick it up, and it's like a touchscreen menu up here, bro. You can sit here for hours and just eat sushi. It's wild out here, guys. It's wild. Bro, what in the hell is that? Uh, why is that a thing? Let's, let's look up close and get some, some detail. That's disgusting. Even though it doesn't even have the face of a spider. It's still creepy, my dudes. Bro, so we got an army of Doraemon. I don't know if you guys know what Doraemon is. It's like that Japanese cartoon. Man, I only saw it a few times, but it's pretty cute. It's a cute character. It's funny. And there's like, there's like 20 of them here. That's so cool. They were like taking pictures of all. How cute. This is, this is great. I love it. Okay, so I'm at a, uh, it's like a sacred temple, man. Look at these temples, bro. Like they're still like perfect. Like you know this is probably mad old, but like they still keep it up. Like the maintenance. It's beautiful, honestly, guys. Like this video is probably only gonna do with so much justice, but I promise y'all that's crazy. Okay guys, so it's the last day I'm gonna be in Japan. It's, oh my God, I'm looking at my face, I look sweaty. Yo, it's so hot over here, but listen, Japan was dope. That's all I gotta say, man, it was a good time. I'm gonna be uh, definitely coming back here one day. So I'm about to head over to the train station and over to uh, the airport. And uh, yeah, I'll make sure I show you guys some, uh, some clips of uh, some cool stuff that I did. See you later.